I'm Rodney Carrington, and you're watching Bit by Bit. Fat girls, fat girls, fat girls, turn me on. Fat girls, fat girls, fat girls, turn me on. So anyway, he said I went home. You know, I was excited. I told my wife, Toby Keith asked me to help him write a movie. My wife goes, why? <laughs> <laughs> why? Fuck, I don't know. You know, maybe he asked everybody else. They all said no. He got to the bottom of the barrel, and bingo, I'm in. I don't know. Could you at least try to be happy? So he sends me his movie idea, and it's two pages long after I printed it out. Had three characters and what their names were and what they were wearing in great detail. That was it. I got scared because I didn't know how I was going to tell him he didn't have no movie idea. I'm serious. I called him on the phone. I said, listen, Toby, and I was like real kid gloves, you know. I said, hey, uh, you know, you got three good characters, and we know their names real good and what they're wearing real, real good. But you don't have a story. And he said to me, he said, come over to ranch on Monday. Let's just knock it out. I thought, well, you know, if he's mowing your pasture, that might work. But we're writing a movie. Do you know what that entails? <laughs> I didn't say any of that. It sounded, you know. But he's too big to say shit like that, too, you know. <laughs> so I just started, you know, that Monday, I'm driving to his house. He lives an hour and a half away from me. And the whole time I'm driving, I'm like, why did I agree to this shit? I don't even know him. What if I get over and I say something he don't like me, and then I'm trapped there? How am I going to leave? You know, what if he's weird? What if he's gay? Shit. What if he's, I don't really know him. I mean, this could be some sort of ploy to get me into the Toby Key sex dungeon. You know, I'm cute. I can see why somebody want me in their dungeon. But he's a big son of a bitch. He gets me on the ground. I'm toast. Nothing I can do. Hold my breath. Hope I pass out. That's all I can do. And I don't think you can hold your breath when you're crying. I'm guessing. <laughs> Obviously, that movie would have never got made had that shit happened. We'd still be under a tree crying somewhere. So I get to his house, and that son of a bitch is manicured, 160 acres, manicured like Disney World. There's not a grass out of place. Mexicans everywhere. And uh, it's his house. Don't judge me. I'm driving down Toby's driveway, and I'm passing the lake, the giraffes, and that little colored actor Webster's out there. It's his house, y'all can stop judging. He's sitting on a giraffe wearing a Toby Keith hat waving. I went, son of a bitch, that's Webster. And I pull up to Toby's giant mansion he built, he lives in, he's standing up there cocked on the front porch in that Toby Keith stance that I now know he practices in the mirror. Because I've seen him. And I'm looking through the windshield of my truck. He's got jeans, boots, ripped up shirt, and a cowboy hat and sunglasses standing there like this. And I'm looking through the windshield thinking, is he fixing to sing to me? <laughs> what the fuck? I got out of the truck. I go, hey, Toby. He goes, what's going on, son? I said, oh, hell. I saw Webster up by the gate there. He said, Gary Coleman's over there feeding the cows. <laughs> I thought, that's the nicest shit I've ever seen, you putting them little out-of-work child actors back to work like that. <laughs> anyway, he said, come on, let me show you around. Basically, what he was saying was, come on, let me show you some shit you'll never, ever have. Come on. <laughs> and I followed him, and he does this, I'm a real cool country music superstar walk, kind of like I'm a badass. Look at me, I'm Toby Keith, kind of walk, you know. And I'm trying to do it behind him, you know, trying to match him, you know. Security guard saw me and I went, oh, shit. And then I went back to my regular walk. <laughs> Just a spoonful of sugar makes the medicine go down, the medicine go down, the medicine. Right. Toby Keith was so kind to come down there and play in that video. He, he made $40 million, I think, that year. He didn't make nothing for that. He got a some bag of chips and a hot dogs, what he got. We did a movie together that was real big in Poland called Beer From My Horses.